For I have received of the Lord that which also I delivered unto you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. And when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, Take, eat, this is my body, which is broken for you. This do in remembrance of me. After the same manner, also he took the cup. When he had supped, saying, This cup is the New Testament in my blood. This do ye, as oft as ye drink it, in remembrance of me. For as often as ye eat this bread and drink this cup, do ye do show the Lord's death till he come. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and blood of the Lord. But let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. For he that eateth and drinketh unworthily eateth and drinketh damnation to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. For this cause many are weak and sickly among you, and many sleep. As we prepare and receive the Lord's body and the blood, as we do it in remembrance of him, he that eat it and drank it unworthily, eat it and drank it damnation to himself. The Bible said, let a man examine himself and let him see that he's worthy to eat the body, drink the blood of the Lord. So as we normally do, we ask the Lord to forgive us, to cleanse our hearts, to cleanse our mind, that we may not eat the body and the blood of the Lord unworthily. Many are sick, many have died for not taking the word. Let us pray. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for your loving kindness. Thank you for your rich word on today that was sent through your manservant. Oh, God, we ask that you bless us, ask you forgive us, God. If we don't say anything, God, that's contrary, displeasing to our words and our will, oh, God, that we may not eat your body or drink your blood unworthily. And these are the blessings we ask in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Jesus said, this is my body, which is broken for you. As often as you eat this, you do it in remembrance of me. Shall we eat? Apart from the shedding of the blood, there's no remission of sin. As we walk in the light, as he is in the light, we have fellowship with one another, and the blood of Jesus Christ shall make us whole. Shall we drink? Jesus said, for often as you do this, you do it in remembrance of me. Gentlemen, you may now go and serve. Praise God together. 
Shall we all stand? Amen. As Ella Ortiz give a final remarks on benediction, we remind all the parents and the children to please go down uh, to the multi-purpose room to see Missionary Gregory and the children's church staff to receive your school supplies. The scripture tells us that there, and we left with a song. So. Oh, Father God, Lord, thank you for being in the room with us today, Lord. Lord, for just making a way, Lord, and just clearing our minds, Lord, knowing that we can stand on your word, Lord, and that we can ask anything in your name, and you would do it, Lord. We just thank you, Lord. We just thank you, Lord. We just thank you, Lord. Now may our Lord Jesus Christ himself, and God, who is our Father, who loved us and gave us eternal comfort and good hope through grace, comfort your heart in every good work and word, and all of God's people would say, Amen. Hallelujah.